Very, very good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It gives us great pleasure to welcome all of you. Today is a historic day, and we take the pleasure to welcome all of you for the seaplane demo launch by the Honorable Chief Minister of Andhra Pradesh, Sri Nara Chandra Babu Naidu Garu, and Honorable Union Minister of Civil Aviation, Sri Ram Mohan Naidu, here at the Punnami Ghat, Vijayawada. This landmark event will unveil seaplanes as a new mode of travel, providing a unique blend of convenience and adventure while enhancing regional connectivity across our scenic waterways. Our Honorable Chief Minister has just arrived with a huge round of applause. Let's all give a hearty and a warm welcome to the Honorable Chief Minister. Andhra Pradesh, driven by a vision to enhance connectivity to its two cities, boasts of a network of seven operational airports. The Visakhapatnam Vijayawada Tirupati holds international status, while Rajamandri Karnul Kadapa primarily serves as domestic travel needs. It gives us great pleasure to welcome our Honorable Chief Minister of Andhra Pradesh, Sri Nara Chandra Babu Naidu Gariki, Savininga Swagatam Palkutanam. This is a landmark event which will unveil the seaplanes as a new mode of travel, providing a unique blend of convenience and adventure. Ladies and gentlemen, the centerpiece of this event is the Day Havilland Twin Otter Series of 400 seaplane. Known for its durability and versatility, this aircraft is engineered for both water and conventional runways. It gives us great pleasure to welcome the Honorable Chief Minister. We also welcome Sri K. Ram Mohan Naidu Garu, Honorable Union Minister of Civil Aviation. And we take the pleasure to welcome Sri B.C. Janathan Reddy Garu, Honorable Minister of Roads and Buildings. Sri Kandula Durgesh Garu, Honorable Minister for Tourism. And we also welcome Sri Suresh Kumar, IAS Garu, Secretary to Government. And also, we take the pleasure to welcome Ajay Singaru, Chairman and Managing Director, SpiceJet Limited, Sri Yogesh Gargaru, Regional Vice President, Asia and Pacific and Middle East, De Havilland Aircraft and of Canada Limited Official. And we also welcome Kesanini Sivanath Garu, Chinni Garu, MP from Vijayawada, and Secretary of Tourism, Vinay Chand Garu. And we also welcome Mantina Ramraj Garu, APTDC Chairman. And also Sri Praveen Aditya, IAS Garu, Managing Director, Andhra Pradesh Airport Development Corporation. Alage Sri Sankesh Mehta Garu, Director, Domestic Transport Division, Minister of Civil Aviation, Government of India. Hearty and a warm welcome, sir. Sri Nukasani Balaji Gari Koda Swagatam Palkutunam. Collector Gari Guda Vedic Medic Rawals in the Gahanisana. Well, Karikramani, Lanchananga, Jyoti Prajwal and Toti Praram Minchwals in the Gari Quest Jesu, Gauru Nilayana Mukimantri Garu, Jyoti Prajwal and Achevals in the Gahanavichesana. Ladies and gentlemen, we are celebrating this historic occasion. Your presence will make this day even more memorable as we embark on a new era in travel and tourism. This is a unique opportunity to explore the seaplane up close, marveling at its advanced features. Distinguished guests from the aviation industry, from the state government, central government, today will put forth and discuss the transformative impact of this innovation on tourism and promising economic prospects which it brings to our beloved state of Andhra Pradesh. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. May I now request our Secretary to Government, Infrastructure and Investment, Government of Andhra Pradesh, Sri Suresh Kumar IAS Garu, to give the welcome address.
అందరికీ నమస్కారం ఆనరబుల్ చీఫ్ మినిస్టర్ ఆఫ్ ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ శ్రీ నారా చంద్రబాబు నాయుడు గారు ఆనరబుల్ యూనియన్ మినిస్టర్ ఆఫ్ సివిల్ ఏవియేషన్ శ్రీ కె రామ్మోహన్ నాయుడు గారు ఆనరబుల్ మినిస్టర్ ఇన్ఫ్రాస్ట్రక్చర్ ఇన్వెస్ట్మెంట్ రోడ్స్ అండ్ బిల్డింగ్ శ్రీ బీసీ జనార్దన్ రెడ్డి గారు ఆనరబుల్ మినిస్టర్ టూరిజం కల్చర్ అండ్ సినిమాటోగ్రఫీ శ్రీ కందుల దుర్గేష్ గారు చైర్మన్ అండ్ ఎండి స్పైసర్ శ్రీ అజయ్ సింగ్ గారు రీజనల్ వైస్ ప్రెసిడెంట్ ఆఫ్ డే హ్యావ్ల్యాండ్ ఎయిర్క్రాఫ్ట్ కెనడా యోగేష్ గారు జాయింట్ సెక్రటరీ మినిస్ట్రీ ఆఫ్ సివిలియేషన్ అసన్ బా చుబా గారు ఆనరబుల్ ఎంపీ ఆనరబుల్ చైర్పర్సన్స్ అదర్ పబ్లిక్ రిప్రజెంటేటివ్స్ ఎస్టీమ్డ్ అఫీషియల్స్ ఫ్రమ్ ది గవర్నమెంట్ ఆఫ్ ఇండియా అండ్ ది స్టేట్ గవర్నమెంట్ ఆల్ డిస్టింగ్విష్డ్ గర్ల్స్ మీడియా రిప్రజెంటేటివ్స్ అండ్ ఆల్ ది people from vijayawada and across the state assembled here for this program very good morning to everyone today marks an extraordinary occasion as we celebrate the launch of andhra pradesh sea plane demo at this iconic prakasham barrage on krishna river this initiative brings transformative vision into reality establishing a new pathway in regional aviation and setting a benchmark for innovation in infrastructure and connectivity guided by the visionary leadership of our honorable chief minister andhra pradesh has steadily advanced its role in the aviation sector a journey that has begun with significant initiatives in 2014 during this foundational period from 2014 to 19 we laid the groundwork for an expanded aviation ecosystem in andhra pradesh through strategic infrastructure development impactful aviation summits air shows which highlighted andhra pradesh as an emerging leader in the india's regional aviational landscape unfortunately in the last 5 years we could not take this forward today we are fortunate that we are building on these efforts with a comprehensive aviation policy a strategy that prioritizes regional comp- regional connectivity and fosters dynamic growth this initiative will bring far reaching benefits to the people and economy of andhra pradesh by unlocking new travel routes particularly through through sea planes and smaller aircrafts we are transforming the way people connect across the state tourism for instance stands to gain enormously our state abundant with natural beauty from this from the serene krishna river to godavari river the state will be more accessible than ever with sea planes we are introducing travelers to a unique experience that celebrates both the culture and the natural wonders of andhra pradesh making our state an iconic destination in the global tourism moreover enhanced connectivity which is essential to inclusive growth will open doors for underserved and remote areas bringing them closer to the amenities and opportunities found in the major cities our collaboration with the government of india's regional connectivity scheme rcs udan is central to this vision as part of this partnership we are launching the prakasham barrage as a water aerodrome with ongoing discussions to introduce additional water aerodromes across key locations in the state connectivity is the backbone of development and this initiative exemplifies our commitment to ensuring that no region is left behind the economic impact of sea plane connectivity will be profound by turning our vast water resources into transportation hubs we are embracing a model of sustainable development that serves both urban and rural areas increased access to remote and scenic locations will drive local business growth create new jobs and encourage investment in infrastructure hospitality and related industries this sea plane project therefore is not just an a 